What's up everybody? Today is May 8th and Good Good is hosting a meetup at Dobson Ranch. And I don't know if anyone's ever been to one of these meetups, but I'm going to show you what it's like from the viewer's perspective, from the spectator perspective of what it's like at one of these Good Good events. They obviously make a video about it, but you see it from their lens, I'm going to show you from mine. So let's get over there. So first thing, if you ever come to one of these, get here early. I, they start at six. I got here at five, 10. I am way back here. The event is way over there. I mean, I am nowhere close to it. I guess I should have guessed that one. They have like millions of followers and there's only so many places to park. So get here early if you come. So if you're curious about how many people actually come to this thing, just give an idea on, there's still 30 minutes till they start playing. There's so many people gonna be here. Before they went out to the first tee, they were selling some merchandise, they were doing some putting contests, they had some booths set up, a lot of stuff to do before they went to the first tee. Now we headed to the first tee and we watched them tee off. Unfortunately, this did happen though. I would let Gary hit me with the ball in my hand. Oh, yeah, I'm not yeah. saying. As you can imagine, people are just lining the tee box and Garrett just smoked someone. So yeah, I did say that right. Garrett did smoke someone, which like, to be honest, I probably would have hit some wayward one as well. That's gotta be a little nervy. I definitely wouldn't have smoked low left. I would have been high right crowd, would have been scattered for sure, but someone took one to the stomach. So I guess bring some pads if you show up to one of these. All jokes aside, the kid that was hit was okay. It did clip him in the arm and Garrett felt really bad about it. He drove him around for the rest of the round, gave him some ice and gave him a bunch of free merch, which was a cool gesture. Before anyone attacks Garrett on this, it was bound to happen. People get hit at the PGA Tour events, and there was more people at this event than I've seen at PGA Tour events. It was just bound to happen. A very unfortunate situation that happened for both of them. So we watched them hit all their shots. We go up to the green, watch them hit their putts. It was, again, super cool to see how many people surrounded this hole. Definitely a cool environment and a cool situation for Luke Kwan because he did this. Coming to this good, good championship is definitely cool, but it's definitely harder to watch. Like, it's easier to watch the pros in person at a PGA Tour event. There's so many people here, which really shows how much pull they have over, like, the pro guys. I mean, they're just, they're just a bunch of guys that make videos, which is pretty sick. After play, we went to their top tracer range. This was before anyone showed up. And this was during the night when everyone was whacking balls. They had some cool events going on. They did some close to the pin challenges. I ended up hitting a pretty decent one here. Definitely wasn't going to win. And then we did some long drive where we had Nick Del Fico just sending him out there. Hitting it 343. That's pretty good. And then we had Gipper Finau, Tony Finau's brother, just absolutely sending it. This was 353. His longest one of the night was 373. And then at the end of the night, they did a little exhibition with the good, good guys where they were just absolutely ripping them out there, seeing how far they can get. So for these good, good championships, I definitely say if they have one in your area, definitely come in to um, the C1. It's a cool environment. Obviously, like I said, hard to see all the golf shots, but it's just kind of cool having this huge crowd. And I would say just kind of watch where you stand. This is probably the first time they've ever hit someone, but it's just bound to happen. I mean, in golf, 
like a few degrees, the ball goes uh, very far offline. So, you know, with this many people, it's bound to happen. So just, just watch. Don't, don't stand up the right or left. Stand behind him. Why not? Overall, super cool event. Definitely recommend if you're in the area of a good, good event, go out to it. It's going to be a little tougher to see all the golf, but it's a really cool experience. 100% need to go to one.